So, I'm, like, surfing the TV channels, per se, and, like, I come across, you know, TNA Wrestling, Thursday Night Impact. I'm used to that. I'm like, yo, that's dope. I go up the channels a few more times, and I come across WWE. I was like, what? Hold on a second. Rewind, because I went up two more channels. Rewind. <laughs> Oh, it was WWE NXT, and I'm like, oh, snap, two wrestling shows on at the same time. Just NXT only runs for an hour, so for the first hour of TNA, they're really competing against NXT. I just noticed that NXT today has the voice of JR on commentary and someone else that I don't know the name of. That's okay, but um, what do you guys watch, really, WWE or TNA on the given Thursday? Are you an NXT fan or are you a TNA fan? Me, like, I thought this was going to be hard, but I watched, you know, some NXT and whatnot, and I prefer TNA. It's a more well-put-together show so far, um, actually for the past few years. Uh, NXT, you know, it's cool, you know, but I'm not really feeling it. So, I like TNA, because Jeff Hardy's on there, yo, uh, Sting, Hulk Hogan, like, just seeing all these like characters and what like I just love it all you know, like Bubba Ray, Devon, whatever is going on on TNA. It's fun, it's exciting, and they don't quit. So um, that's what I prefer. I prefer TNA over WWE NXT on Thursday nights. However, when it comes to all domination, I still say WWE Monday Night Raw, rock on. Um, Friday Night SmackDown, I watch every now and then. It's not that bad. It was amazing back in the day with Kane, Undertaker, and Boogeyman when they were all on the same card on the same show. Now that, that was entertaining and dope. That was like the dark ages of SmackDown for me. I absolutely loved it. I had to make sure I got them every day just to watch it. Uh, anything else am I missing? Uh, you know. And then I guess WWE, like, uh, uh, what is it, man? The show where they replay some stuff, some old stuff, uh, high, like, I don't know, Vintage Collection. Um, I guess that's a popular show because it, you know, while it's on, things were trending on Twitter, which I never saw coming. And uh, the Experience, which is basically a recap of Raw and SmackDown. I don't watch for the life of me. I will glimpse at it every now and then, but I'm probably never going to watch it. I used to watch WWE back in the day when there was like Metal, um, WWE uh, Velocity, uh, WWE Excess. Um, yeah, like th th those were really cool shows. They should definitely bring back Saturday Night Main Event. I think that was a successful event. Um, I like how they incorporated, you know, the former Great American Bash into what was the July 4th weekend. That was pretty, you know, smart of them. Uh, like, as of Thursday nights, though, TNA is like the king. Uh, TNA does give SmackDown a run for its money, but something about Monday Night Raw, just being Monday Night Raw, is, is what gravitates me towards Monday Night Raw ruling the rest of the wrestling um jcw like i'll watch it sometimes you know i'm very entertained when i watch jcw but i'm not a regular watcher uh so yeah so that's basically it tell me man what do you watch more though on a thursday night nxt or um what is it uh tna yeah the show that i said i watched and i can't even remember the name Woo. okay yo so yeah this is dan the man and i'm out like a light